we're going to be looking at the 2016 Trolls Happy Meal toys from McDonald's. So I am really, really excited to take a look at these toys. We have all six of the toys to look at today. But before we do that, we will be taking a look at the box. And at the end of the video, we will also be looking at the new games on the McPlay app. So let's go ahead and get started. So let's start by taking a look at the box. So let's go ahead and open it up. On this side of the box, we have the red side with the happy face. And here is Happy, and he's got the troll wig on. Right here, we have the Ronald McDonald House charity side of the box. It says, your Happy Meal helps keep RMHC families close to the care and comfort they need. It says you need to follow the correct lines to help bring Sophie the things she needs. So each of the things that Sophie needs has two lines on it, and you figure out which line will take the thing that she needs to her. So this is the family, and we have two lines to choose from. A friend, care, and comfort. Then you need to figure out which of those lines ends up at Sophie. Next, you have the troll side of the box. And the last side of the box is the McPlay side of the box. It says, get down with the goodness of delicious apple slices. And you can go full troll when you pop out the hairband and show off your new look. And it also says that you can download the McPlay app, scan your toy, and play some sweet games, which we will be doing at the end of the video. And at the very bottom of the box, right here, it says what toys are coming up next. So the next two toys that we are going to have is the Hello Sanrio, which is some Hello Kitty toys, and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles toy. So that is really awesome. Now what we need to do is pop out our troll headband. So you can see these little lines all around the sides of the box. So let's go ahead and pop it out. we have our trolls headband and to adjust the size all you do is you just match this up with whatever size you want so say you have a small head you would go all the way over here put these two pieces together like that and if your head is larger what you would do is just go all the way to the end and then put it on so that is really cool now let's go ahead and take a look at the toys. So the first toy we have is toy number one. This is the Poppy toy. So let's go ahead and open it up. So the first thing that we have is our little token piece right here. It has a picture of Poppy on it. And on the back it says you can download the McPlay app, scan your toy, and unlock the game. So each of these toys is going to have this little like token piece with it. They all have the same thing on the back except it'll show the toy that is in the bag. And they have a different picture on it. So this one is Poppy. And then we have our instructions. So they, I accidentally got two of these in my bag. It just shows us putting the pencil topper on top of the pencil. So that is pretty easy. And here is what our Poppy pencil topper looks like. So she looks really cool. She's got some really beautiful pink hair right here. And here is what her face looks like. Super, super cute. Really nicely detailed. Looks really awesome. And then we have our pencil, and our pencil looks like it's a purple colored pencil, and we have some pictures on it, so that looks really cool. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the pencil, and we're going to take our poppy pencil topper, and we're just going to place the pencil inside, like that. So that is really cool. Next, we have a Trolls Activity book, and here's what it looks like. It looks really awesome. On the inside, we have a beautiful picture of Poppy. We can write her name on it, or your name, color it. And then it also shows a little game that we can play where we try to find the one in the picture over here. So it gives us the first one right there. And then we try to find the other pictures of her face. You can see they all have different expressions, and then you gotta find them. So that is really awesome. Then we have a coloring page, which is super, super cute. We have another page where we can put some stickers, and we have our stickers right here. Let me show you what those look like. So here are the stickers that she came with. Really cool, and we can take these and place them in the book. So let's just take our little poppy right here. 
and we're just gonna place her somewhere. So that is really awesome and we can just fill up the whole scene with our stickers. Next we have a little grid here with some pictures and what we can do is try to match the pictures and draw our own Poppy and the other character right there. I'm not sure who that is. I think that's Branch. So next we have one of those games where you go from number to number. So we would just start at number one and trace the whole thing and it'll show us a picture. We have a tic-tac-toe page and a maze. So that is really, really awesome. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try writing with our colored pencil here. So let me just write her name. I'm gonna write it right here. I'm gonna write Poppy. So there it is. Colored pencil turned out really great. That was toy number one, the Poppy toy. Next we have toy number two and this one is Branch. So let's go ahead and open it up. So the first thing that we have in the bag is our little Branch token on the back. It just tells us about the McPlay app. We have our instructions which just says to put the pencil topper on the pencil. And here is our Branch pencil topper. So here's what that looks like. He's got some really cool black hair and he's kind of like a Kind of like a bluish gray color. Looks really awesome. And here is our branch pencil. So it looks a little bit different than the other one. So looks really cool. Now one of the things I did notice about this one is this color pencil has different colors. So there's blue. If you turn it, there's green and purple. So that looks really awesome. Now what we're going to do is take our pencil and place the pencil topper on it. Cool. Next we have our activity book for Branch. So you can see that the activity books are different. So that is really cool. So you don't get like a whole bunch of the same kind. So here's what it looks like. We have a really awesome picture with Branch and Poppy. And you can write your name or another name on there. And you can color it. Then we have another one where we have to figure out all of the differences. So you can see they already circled this one right here with this little guy right there is purple and on this side it's pink and it says that there are 14 differences that you can find. Really cool. Another page where we can put our stickers which are right here. Here are those stickers. They look really awesome. I love those stickers. Really cool. So let's take Branch and place him in the scene like that and you can just fill up the whole thing. Here is our coloring page. Then we have some more tic-tac-toe. We have a giant maze. And then we can finish creating our branch picture right there so we can draw his face and his hair and then color it. So that is really awesome. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna open up the activity book and we're gonna try out our colored pencil. So I'm going to try writing with the green side to do the B in branch. There's the B. Let's try the blue for the R. And then let's see if we can get some purple for the A. So that is really awesome. Let's see if we just write normal. Oh, that is so cool. So that was toy number two, the branch toy. Here is toy number three, Gaia Diamonds. Let's open it up. And here is Guy Diamonds token. Super sparkly, that is so cool. Here's the back. Here are the instructions. Again, just says put your troll topper on your pencil. And let's go ahead and take him out. So here's what he looks like. He's got this white hair. And he's even got a little bit of a sparkle to him. Uh, not as sparkly as I thought he would be. He's just got a little bit of a sparkle. I love his green nose though. It looks really cool. And then of course he's got his pencil. So here's what his pencil looks like. So that is really cool. And this is just a blue pencil. So let's go ahead and place him on. So here is our activity book that comes with Guy Diamond, and here's Guy Diamond right here, and here's DJ in the background. So the first page right there is a nice little coloring page where you can write your name or their name. Then we have our page for our stickers. 
Here are what the stickers look like. Really awesome. I love these stickers. They are so cool. Let's take the uh, Guy Diamond sticker and place him in the scene somewhere. Like that. And of course you can just fill it up with all of your stickers. Right here uh, we have a really cool picture. It's one of those like color by numbers. So it says that you have like teal here. We've got this green. We've got the pink. And each one has a number. So if you were looking for number three, you would do this part in pink. Then four is orange. And then pink again. So this would go pink, orange, pink right there on that little like bush in the background. So that is really cool. Next we have a, another coloring page. That one looks really awesome. It looks like it's really challenging. Got a lot of little pieces that we can color. Really cool. Then we have a maze. So we got to figure out which of these lines goes up to Guy Diamond. Here's a picture of Guy Diamond where you can finish drawing him. Then of course we've got another one of those grid pictures where you can try to draw the picture over here, right there. And then the last thing that we have here is the maze. So that is really awesome. So what we're going to do is we're going to write Guy Diamond with his pencil right there. So Guy Diamond has this nice blue colored pencil. So here's what that looks like. Really awesome. That was toy number three, the Guy Diamond toy. Next is toy number four, which is the smidge toy. So this one is actually wrapped kind of differently. Instead of having her in plastic, we have everything else in the plastic. All right, so here is the token. It has smidge on it. Here's the back. Then we have our instructions, which just shows the pencil topper going on the pencil. Here is our smidge pencil topper. So she looks really cool. She's like a nice bright yellow. She's got some teal colored hair. A little pink bow here, a little pink nose. Looks really awesome. And then we have her pencil. So that one looks really cool. And it kind of looks like this is a brown colored pencil. Let's place the pencil in the pencil topper. There. Awesome. And then we have the activity book. So here's what it looks like. It's got smidge on it. And then it's also got Fuzzbert. Here's the inside. Right there, a little picture you can color and put the name. Then we have some tic-tac-toe. We have a picture that you guys can color. We have a place to put our stickers. So here's what the stickers look like. Those look really cool. So let's go ahead and take our smidge sticker. And we're just gonna place it anywhere we'd like. And then of course you can fill up the rest of the stickers on this picture. And then we have a maze, a very big maze. We have some of those number uh, tracing things where you trace from one to, it looks like 34 to find the picture. Then it looks like we have some Sudoku right there. So that's really cool. And then on the back, we can just draw a picture of whatever we'd like. So we can draw like a little troll or ourselves. Really awesome. And right here, we're going to write smidge. So there it is. That looks really cool. That was toy number four, the smidge toy. Next, we have a toy number five, which is Fuzzbert. So it looks like Fuzzbert is already out of the bag. So here's what that looks like. I think he's really funny because he kind of reminds me of Cousin It from the Addams Family. You guys might have never seen that, but that's what he reminds me of. Looks really cool. He's just like green hair on some orange feet because he's just so hairy. And then we have our pencil. Here's what the pencil looks like right there. Looks really cool. We'll place that on our pencil topper. And then, of course, this one comes with a token with Fuzzbert on it. There. And then the instructions just show us putting the Fuzzbert pencil topper on the pencil. And here is the activity book, which has Fuzzbert and Guy Diamond in the background. Here is the picture. We can put our name here and then color that. We also have another coloring picture. Then a maze, 
a place to put our stickers. So the stickers are right here. Look really cool. Let's take our little our little fuzzbert right there. Place him on the page. Oh, it looks like he wants to stick over there. Oh no! Not there! Over here! Alright, so that looks really cool. And then of course you can just stick all the other stickers on there. Next, it looks like we have a Sudoku game. It's kind of like Sudoku, but instead with colors. So that is really cool. And then of course we can color the hair on both of these. And on the back we have some tic-tac-toe, so that is really awesome. So let's go ahead and try out our colored pencil, which looks like it is green. So there it is, I wrote Fuzzbert on it, and that looks really cool. That was toy number five, the Fuzzbert toy. And our last toy, which is toy number six, this one is DJ. So here is our DJ pencil topper, and I love this one. She is so bright and colorful. She's like this nice pink color, and she's got some orange hair, and she just looks really, really cool. I love her little headphones. They are purple, and she's got a little blue nose, so that is really cool. Here is her pencil. So this one is an orange pencil. And we're gonna place the pencil on the pencil topper right there. I love the way this one looks too, that's so cool. So here is DJ's little car right there. It says DJ Suki. Here's the back. We have our instructions, put the pencil topper on the pencil, already did it. And then of course we have our activity book, so here's what it looks like. On the inside we have a coloring page where we can put the name, like the other ones. Right here, it looks like we can maybe cut them out and place them on our characters. I'm not really sure. Oh, okay, I see. So what you're going to do is you're going to find the hair that actually goes with these characters. So what is the hair that goes with them? So, for example, see, so here we have our DJ. And it looks like this is DJ right here. So what we would do is just draw a line. So that is her hair. Then, right here, we have to figure out which hair and pieces go where. So this one right here is her hair. It goes right there in that bubble. If we're looking for this bubble, it would be this one right here with the top of her hair. So that goes right there. Let's see what else we have. Another coloring picture. We have another one of those graphs where you can try to draw this picture over here. Then we have a place for our stickers. So let's take a look at the stickers that she came with. Those are really awesome. So let's get our little DJ one and place it right there. And then of course you can place on the rest of the stickers. And then this one right here is just a maze. So now let's try writing her name. And I'm just gonna put DJ. So there it is and it's got this nice orange color to it. And that was our last toy, toy number six, the DJ toy. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna try out the new games on the McPlay app. So what you're gonna need to do is download the free McPlay app on your smartphone or tablet, open it up, then we're gonna click Let's Play, click See Games. Now if you already have your games unlocked, you can go right here. I think this one might already be unlocked no matter what. I'm not quite sure. So what we can do is we can go to one that is locked if you haven't scanned any toys. Click it to scan your toy. Click on the toy that you want to scan. So we're going to do this one right here. Place her in the back. Like that. Then click unlock a game. and then it will unlock the game that you chose. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna unlock all four of the games that you can get. So the first game that we have here is Hair Do Re Mi. So let's click play. So what we need to do is we will click on one and it'll make a noise. So let's just go ahead and try it out. I think it's kinda like Simon Says.
All right, so let's see if I hit the wrong one, what happens when we mess up. All right, so it says that we got six troll tones, so then you try to beat your score. So let's try out another game. So this one is called DJ's Music Video. So it looks like we get to make our own little music video here and speed up the background. Try some different things here. Try some different music. Try some different colors. So that is really cool. It's like a little music video. So the next game is Hair Pong. It looks like we're going to have to turn our screen for this one. And it looks like we're just going to use the hair to kind of bounce off of this stuff. So let's try it out. So that was really cool. And then we go to another round. And say we miss it. Let's see what happens. So it looks like we have three chances. And then it tells us our points. So then you can try to beat your score. So this one is called the Rock and Troll Slide. This is the last game, so let's try it out. So it looks like we can tilt the screen to make her go one way or another. Oh no, I fell off! And then it tells you your distance, so that is really cool. All right, you guys, so what did you think of the 2016 Trolls Happy Meal Toys from McDonald's? So I thought that these were all really cool. The activity books, the stickers were really awesome. My favorite pencil topper was, of course, Poppy because she just looks so cool. And I think my favorite colored pencil is definitely the one that came with Branch because it is like a rainbow pencil, which is so awesome. I wish they all had rainbow pencils. I love these Trolls hair. I can't stop playing with them. They are so awesome awesome. So which of these was your favorite? And if you guys liked this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and stay tuned for more Happy Meal Toy videos. Come back tomorrow for a new video, and if you liked the video you just saw, don't forget to check out our other videos. Find us on Facebook and other social media, and as always, thanks for watching.